This is my Songdo. Her name's Christine, and she's going to assist me today. She doesn't say much. I know I said that I would make a seam on the side of each seam I've made in the last video to straighten the material, but I tried it and it looked kind of crappy, so I decided against it. Um, but I've already made the seams for the steel wire, for these channels, you can see. And that straightened the whole thing a little, and once the steel wire is inside, it will be even more so, so I think that's okay so far. Um, these channels are made that way, that I make a seam next to each of these dark, and in my case, kind of blue seams, about 1.5 centimeters next to it. And so there's some kind of channel created and you can put the steel wire in there. Um, I haven't done seams here yet because this is the part where the pieces bend the most. So it's kind of difficult. You have to pull the material or the material will be kind of overlapping itself. Then it happens that you make a seam and it looks like this. And that's uncomfortable on the inside and doesn't look good on the outside. So I cut it open again and I'm going to make it soon. So all the seams are finished now and it worked out really well even in the places where the material is so difficult. And I've already made the part where the eyelets are going to be. This part. I just uh, wrapped the material in and made a seam. And you should uh, be careful not to get too close to the corner with the seam. Try it out, you see what I mean. And here's where the steel wire will be. And the corset has turned out to be very symmetrical. The ends of the corset are the same length. It's always a good sign. And almost looks like one. <laughs> so, oops. I'm looking forward to the next video because then I'm going to use the big girl tools and some metal and this is going to be fun. I like hammers.